Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is on the Pat McGrath lip products. So I've got the Pat McGrath Labs um, mini lip glosses and the mini lipsticks. Um, I just thought it's a good way to try out um, the lip products because they're in minis rather than buying full size. So um, I wanted to test these out on camera because why not and I just thought I'll just swatch it for you guys so I have the Pat McGrath Labs mini lust gloss um, this is the skin show warm version this is the first like launch they've done and this contains flush flesh for bronze temptation and flesh fantasy those three shades of glosses um, so this retails for $36 um, the single like full-size lip gloss retails for 45 Australian dollars so 36 is um, Australian dollars and I got this off Sephora and then we have the um, Pat McGrath Labs mini matte trans lipstick so this is the color blitz trio version again this is the first edition so these are limited edition packets the colors that are inside i think they are like from the original line i'm not sure but this also retails for 36 dollars and one single lipstick is 60 dollars so that is quite expensive so i thought i'll buy the mini and like just test it out and I just have way too many lipsticks anyway so mini just works out great and this has Elson, Obsessed and Full Panic those three shades so I'm just going to uh, you know swatch them on my lips and on the back of my hand and just show you what they look like I'm not wearing any lipstick or lip product on my lips right now so let's start with the glosses um, because the lipsticks may stain my lips so uh, this is what the packaging looks like even the um, I think the uh, like other things like the eyeshadow comes in packets like this like I'm not too sure but yeah this is so extra Pat McGrath Labs is so expensive and it's just you know so extra so it comes in a foil packet like this um, so the three mini lip glosses are in there and then it just has like gold confetti like so extra so um, yeah like the packaging is like it's not flimsy or anything it's a like good quality foil so let's cut open this and swatch them okay I'm not gonna like pour this out because it's just gonna get everywhere but I'm just gonna pull out the lip glosses so these are the three shades of the glosses they're like nice and nude um, so we have flesh fantasy which is this one uh, Flesh 4, which is this one, and uh, Bronze Temptation, which is this one. It doesn't even say on the packaging how much it contains. Um, anyway, these are made in the USA. The Bronze Temptation just has a bit of slight shimmer to it. The rest is just like a cream finish. Okay, so let's go light to dark as always. The first shade I'm swatching is Flesh Fantasy. So keep in mind, I have nothing on my lips. Like there's nothing at all so I just wanted to quickly show you the uh, doe food applicator this is what it looks like it's a sponge doe food applicator but it's like pretty flat so you can get a full lip coverage with it so you don't have to keep dipping again and again I like the wand and uh, this is the shade it is flesh fantasy it doesn't have like a crazy scent to it it's just like a light kind of powdery but it's not too overpowering um, it doesn't bother me um, so yeah I mean it's not like overpowering or anything like it's okay and um, the shade so this is the lighter shade in the trio and it's not too light it suits my my skin um, it just makes my lips look a little bigger and plumpier it's just very natural to my lips like they're you know very natural so I could go with like a lip liner underneath and apply this and it will look really nice as well or you can wear it on its own I actually really like this color 
So this is Flesh Fantasy. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply Flesh Fantasy on the back of my hand. This is what it looks like. So it's like a pinky nude, but it's not like too light that it doesn't suit my skin tone, which is a tan, dusky skin tone. I like it. And the formula is like not tacky at all. Like it doesn't stick. It's just like gloss and it's like plump. Like it's just wet. I really like it. It's a nice gloss. It's not sticky or anything. So I really like this. Next shade is Bronze Temptation. So this is Bronze Temptation. This also suits me. This is like a deep peach with golden shimmer to it. But the shimmer is not really visible. It's just like a little reflective um, but yeah this is what it looks like compared to the previous one it's just deeper with some golden shimmer but again this like looks nice on the lips it's nothing too you know over the top um, I like it I like this as well again it will look nice with like a brown lip liner underneath and this on top I think it'll look really nice so this is bronze temptation next shade is flesh 4 so flesh 4 is a deep true brown color um, this is darker than my lips and my skin so yeah but it's still a really nice shade um, I like it again so there's one like light medium and a deep shade um, and this is nice as well so if you're wearing something light on the eyes and pop this on it will be really nice like it's like a bolder nude you know what I mean um, but yeah it's nice it's like a true brown color this is what flesh 4 looks like on the back of my hand so let's open the lipsticks oh my god these lipsticks are so cute look at that they're tiny and I love the packaging it's like this is what the um, full size one looks like as well they're black with the gold like lip you just open it like and you know you have your lipstick so let's try these on the lips they're going light to dark with this one the first shade we're gonna try is full panic so when you open it this is what it looks like and they're meant to be matte lipsticks so this is all the product that you get okay let's go oh oh pigmented so pigmented Oh wow, that looked different in the tube and it looks different on my lips. I thought it was going to be much lighter. And I prefer the lipstick on my lips. Like I thought it was going to be light and I'm not, I was not going to like it. Sorry about the messy application with no lip liner or anything. But oh my god, this is one swipe pigmentation like um, I mean I've just built up a little bit but you just like swipe a little and then you get full color I really like it so this is full panic and I love this shade so much this will look really nice in the spring and summer um, very 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 beautiful it's a comfortable matte it's not very drying it's like how a MAC lipstick feels like the MAC matte lipsticks yeah, they're very comfortable, they're very pigmented, and I love this shade. Looking in the tube, I thought the shade was going to be light, and I was not going to like it, but I really, really like it. So this is Full Panic, and it's a very beautiful fuchsia pink shade. I love it. So that is Full Panic. And this is what it looks like on the back of my hand. So the next shade we're going to try out is Obsessed. So the next shade is Obsessed and ooh, it is so pretty. It's a true Fanta orange shade. Like, you know, it's just neutral. It, it's not too warm. Or it's not too cool. It's a very beautiful neutral bright orange. It's like just a plain Fanta orange. It's so beautiful and it suits my skin tone. So. 
I was worried because some oranges don't suit skin tones like mine um, but this will definitely suit a lot of different people and this is perfect for summer and this applied beautifully because normally orange lipsticks are like kind of patchy you know I've noticed that a lot but this is very very beautiful I love it and I'm obsessed with it and this is the shade next to full panic obsessed it's like proper orange shade I love it last and final shade we're gonna be trying is Elson this is Elson and very pretty autumn winter red it's like a blue base red it's like a deep blue base red very very beautiful uh, perfect for um, you know a night out it's like a nice bold lip um, I love it and it makes my teeth look very white um, but yeah, I love I love this shade. It's very beautiful. I love the trio. All three shades were beautiful And this is what Elton looks like next to those two Absolutely beautiful. I love it. Those were all the uh, Pat McGrath Labs um, lip glosses and the matte lipsticks um, that I have I really hope that you guys enjoyed and you know you saw the swatches so you can go buy the trios or buy them singularly I really like both of the formulas obviously I've not worn them all day so I can't give you an opinion on that just yet I will test them out and let you know what um, you know how long they last if they are worth it but the formula and the comfortability on the lips is just so good like the lipsticks are you know like a hydrating matte and they feel very comfortable I don't even feel like I've got something on the lips and the pigmentation is amazing it's just like one swipe and you get perfect opaque lips and the lip glosses are not sticky and tacky they just feel plump on the lips and they make your lips look nice and juicy and big I like both of the formulas so I'm just excited to tie them out and you know let you guys know what um you know how long, like they wear and stuff you know what i mean more information about them but i just wanted to open it on camera first and like test out the colors and show you you know a a swatch and um it's just a good way to try out pat mcgrath lip products without having to spend so much money on it I've also heard really good things about the lip liners. So I want to definitely check them out. But for the price and you know the mini sizes, and you want to test out some shades, this is a very good option. So if you'd like to get the mini ones, they are in, available in Sephora. If they're still available, I'll leave them um, down below I'll, in the description box. I'll link them down. But yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a massive thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!